Hey everyone, Ken Surf's here and it's time for a Sunday shave. Well, I tell you, it's been pretty hot and uh, the family's been working real hard in the backyard the last few days and I was sweating like a pig and I was dreaming of the cold, cooler weather. So I decided today I'm going to do a shave with uh, Sterling's Margaritas in the Arctic because there's nothing cooler than uh, <laughs> that's something that's so menthol mentholated that it... Uh, makes it feel like winter again. So we're gonna be using these today. I'm going to use the Mercure Long Handle. I think it's the 23C. I just know it as the Long Handle. And believe it or not, this was the first DE Razor modern one that uh, I got, and actually my wife bought it for me in a kit. And uh, I've had it ever since years now, and it works great. It's The, the head's very similar to the 23, or the uh, 34C but uh, it's got a long handle, which is gonna be nice. And I'm gonna use a blade. I've used Supermax on camera before, but uh, I bought these a while ago and I have not tried them out yet. I heard good things about them. <laughs> we will see. So I'm gonna be using this today. And for the brush, I just wanted something that reminded me of winter, so I'm using the uh, Ken Surf's uh, Winter Edition uh, synthetic brush today. So I hope your week is going good, weekend is going good. I'm gonna put this in here as we're talking and I will load up that uh, razor. We've been in the process of tearing down a, I think it's a 10 foot by eight foot steel shed. It's been up for about 15 years in my backyard. My wife's been asking me, you know, for about three years to get rid of it. And I say, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I got all my stuff in it, man. When I cleaned out my uh, man cave to put in pinball machines, I put a lot of junk in this shed, garden shed. Well, she wants the space to repurpose it for like uh, a lounging area with a fire pit or the uh, barbecue or something. So, man, tearing that thing down for all day yesterday, sawing up the wood, because uh, those sheds, you know, usually you have them raised up off the ground. What a day. So this is gonna make it feel good. All right, so I'm gonna load this blade, the diamond edge. You guys used these before? Oh, and that soap that came from Sweden that I used in my last shave, uh, Adam, thank you. Now he, he mailed me. Oh, it was me who sent you it from Sweden. Thank you, Adam, I do appreciate it, man. The soap from Sweden. All right, so I'll be using this. Let's see here, Supermax. Put this thing in here. Still beat, it's like, can't wait till Monday. <laughs> At least these projects won't be happening. All right, and on the uh, long handle, there is an overhang, see, we'll grab the blade but a uh, very good razor. All right. I'm still working on the props for that uh, golden eye shape. Haven't forgotten. Just this, <laughs> this demolition <laughs> that we've been doing. My wife's been watching Home and Garden TV, you know, fix it in the house, fix her up or all this stuff. So she's got some good ideas. And I don't think I ever would have tore that damn shed down if I wasn't pushed a little. But it's down, gone. Filled up all the trash cans. <laughs> damn. This soap and this brush. There we go. I looked back in the uh, video archives and it's been about a year. There's that menthol. It's been about a year since I used this soap. I think the Apollo 11 anniversary, and that was in July of last year, so. We're going through my inventory going, I need a cool, cold soap. Maybe a bay rum next time, so. After Goldeneye. All right. Hope this blade does good.
doesn't doesn't appear to be tugging. I've used their platinum before. There's several Supermax out there, but this one I've had for a while. By the way, see, I'm rinsing it off. Someone asked, what do, you, do you rinse it? You let it clog up? See, I rinse it off in this little bowl in the sink. Haven't seen any good movies. Yesterday was just fell asleep on the sofa watching reruns of To Tell the Truth. And you guys are pretty cool. If I miss, if it's been like a week or six days since I've done a video, you guys, you're very nice. You're always asking, hey, is everything okay? And it's been four days. I apologize, but uh, <laughs> it's been gardening tasks. the problem with being stuck in the house for four months that uh, you kind of start to go crazy and you want to remodel and want to do stuff. By the way, if you haven't used the soap, soap, I'm feeling the menthol tingling right now. It is great. Another good menthol is Artique. But they didn't have a matching aftershave, at least I didn't have it, so I figured I'd use a soap and a aftershave combo. I haven't had a chance to catch up on a lot of the comments. I will do that this week, gents and ladies. I apologize. Thin, 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 thin. I'll sit for 25 minutes. We'll whip up a lather and we'll have a thick one for you. <laughs> don't need it. I don't need it. You might need it. I don't need a thick lather. Gets the job done. For that GoldenEye shave, remember GoldenEye came out in 1995 one of the longest spaces in between James Bond films since uh, Timothy Dalton uh, had, had did the previous one. I think there was about four years difference. And when he came back, when Pierce Brosnan came back in Goldeneye, I thought, okay, man, I'm gonna be using that gold sensor razor. Uh, one of my favorite colognes or aftershaves from the 90s, the mid 90s was Eternity by Calvin Klein. It's the soap I'm not sure of. If you guys have any suggestions on what soap I should use, let me know. I was going to use, uh, what was it, uh, Taylor of Old Bond Street Peppermint, just because I like it. But uh, I don't think that was out in 1995. And it doesn't have to be from 1995, but I know the aftershave is. Hear the feedback? Well, got me a little bit. Wow, my eyes are uh, burning with the uh, <laughs> the menthol. 
Oh, nice. Ice cold, man. Ice cold menthol. It's actually waking me up. All right. Whoa. One of the best burns in a few weeks. Whoa. Wakes you up, man. <laughs> All right, got me one spot there. Big deal. Very smooth shave. Okay, that blade. All right, no complaints here. You worked. I'll have to actually... Sometimes the second shave with a blade is better than the first. I'll actually uh, use that uh, for a second time on one of the upcoming videos. Oh man, it is just tingling and smells like menthol. Fantastic. That's what I needed. Maybe you need the same. It's hot out there, man. And I imagine when I'm saying Southern California hot, some of you guys in you know the, the Midwest or the, the Southwest or you know the East Coast with a hundred degrees and uh, my sister's over in Dubai right now, hundred and something degrees. So, oh my goodness. All right, you guys have a good uh, week and I look forward to seeing you all very soon. Thank you for watching and stay safe.